Hi, this is Nikki from Webcraft. In this video, I want to show you how to work with the jQuery version of the plugin Splash Screen Pro. So this is the uh, this is the zip that you download from uh, Code Canyon. So let's go ahead and extract it here. Okay. Uh, first, uh, first about the editor. You can find the editor in this folder, Splash Screen jQuery Editor. Uh, so let's open it. You don't need a web server to to work with the editor. So uh, here is the editor. If you, I have uh, I have uh, four other videos that explain how to work with the editor. Uh, they are for the WordPress version, but the editor is identical. So you can uh, check them out in my channel, which will be linked below. So this is the editor, and one of the one of the few differences well actually i think is the only difference between uh, the jquery version and the wordpress version is the way that you upload images here in the jquery version if i want to uh, if i want to place an image here i just uh, click on the on the placeholder image and i have to paste an image url now I have uploaded some images uh, before beforehand to my uh, to my web server, and you should do the same before starting to work on a screen. So I'm just going to copy the URL, paste it here, and you can see that the images the the image is now uh, is now loaded. So. First of all, about the save and load feature. Let's say that you started working on a, on a new screen. Uh, you made some progress and you want to save your work and continue working later. You can just press the save button. Copy and paste this, uh, copy this text. I'm just going to copy it right now. Uh, save it somewhere, whatever you like. Uh, when I refresh the page, you can see that the editor uh, is back to where we started. Now I can press the load button, paste the text that I just copied and press load. So about uh, now, now how do we add the screen to our website? Let me close this. Here I have prepared uh, just a very simple, just a very simple site let me let me open open it in my text editor i'm just going to drag this here as you can see it's just uh, pretty much uh, empty empty uh, html file so first you need uh, you need to copy and paste the css the css file that you're going to find here you copy this CSS file, you also copy this JavaScript file and then in, in your uh, HTML file you just uh, include the CSS and include the JavaScript. You can also check out the documentation which has uh, which goes in a bit more detail how to how to do this exactly. So at this point the uh, the plugin is installed in our website and now we just need to add the uh, to add the screen so let's go back to the editor if i press uh, generate jquery it's going to generate a, some uh, some code that i'm going to copy and it says here paste this code in your site's javascript file before the closing body tag inside the script tag so let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to go back to my HTML file. And just, just before the closing body tag, I'm going to make a new script tag. And I'm going to paste the code here. Now I'm going to save the HTML file. Open it. And this is the this is the uh, screen that we just made. 
Now, now you can see that the uh, the font is not the same. We can fix that by checking uh, the Google Fonts checkbox. Just like that. Let's generate jQuery again. Go back here and paste it. Now if we refresh our uh, our HTML file, you can see that the the font is now added. One more thing, in the zip that you download, there is a, there is a folder, there is a demo folder with uh, eight different demos. When you open a demo, for example, this one, and you click uh, and you click the uh, click the button to close the screen, you will see a text area with load code. From each of these demos, you can copy this load code paste it in the editor by clicking the load function uh, the load button sorry click load and this is the screen you can just see how it's uh, how it's made for example this has a video background uh, you can just click the background uh, tab you can see that it's selected on video it's set to loop muted and uh, yeah, and these are the URLs for uh, each uh, each of the uh, for each format that uh, HTML5 requires. So this is this is pretty much it for the jQuery version of this plugin. As I said, I have uh, four videos explaining uh, in uh, in great detail how to work with this editor. You can find them in my uh, YouTube channel. It will have link below and that's it i'll see you in the next video bye